against Sacred Heart PA. Here's Desiree Crawford, drains the baseline jumper. That is the first play that they always go to in the games. At 16 points against FDU on February 1st, and there is Katie Shepard for three. The Pioneers are taking their first lead of the game, 3-2. Lock down the win for the Blue Devils. Here's Kelsey Cruz for, from three this time, that's good. Extending the lead, seven to three. Williams driving. Hands off, another handoff are under the rim. Some easy ball movement, and Etienne will end up with Samantha Andrade is, to, is used to break it up, and Oyakalome a little long, but, but Cruz with the offensive rebound and the nice touch under the basket. A tough one as she was kind of falling away there. Lopez, uncontested, right-handed layup. She has six off the bench. Trying to just trying to force the issue right there. Shepard, wide open is Hannah Kimmel, and she, uh, not Kimmel, my mistake, that is Caitlin Abella, the freshman Florida of Southeastern Massachusetts, right off the bench and draining a three. Nice range. Asked her to participate on the team, not just be a practice player and a team manager. Williams off the glass. A nice pass down low by Andrades. FD has a chance to take the lead. Thomas for three. It's good. And FDU jumps out to a two-point lead, their first lead since midway through the first half, 35-33, and a timeout taken by Sager Hart with 16 and a half to go. Joanna Lopez has been beast mode down low. Not a lot of defensive effort, and Kelsey Cruz is feeling it from three. 12 seconds, here's Kelsey Cruz. Dishes off to Andrade for three. That's good. Rattles home. And Sinella wants a timeout. Wants to get his defense in order. But FDU is retaking the lead. And Williams just kind of bouldering in there. And Kelsey Cruz with the jumper. Oh, perfect. Two more points for the sophomore. She's got 30. Big rebound for Anastasia Williams. Brianna Thomas for three. Good. Brings the lead back up to five, and FDU needed that. Nobody else. I mean, Oyakalomi can come in as well. She has two fouls, as that Crawford jumper is good. The lead back to five, and Sinella wants a timeout with 4.50 to go. Gives it off to Shepard. She will take a three. That's good. Cuts the lead to two, 64-62. Four minutes left. 60 on the shot clock. One minute to go in regulation. Knights lead by three. Katie Shepard to tie the game. Drains it from way downtown. Top of the key. Pioneers. And FDU is going to make it as tough as possible for them. Thomas going to the rim all day. And the foul. You got to love what you see out of Brianna Thomas. And she is all smiles. Got her team fired up. She go to the line to complete the three-point play. 